Okay, so starting on the outside. So this is the main door that you come in. You come in through here. And then basically this is what you see. You see two sets of doors. That's mine, it's open. And then this one, that is my roommate's. And then on the side here, you have a closet. So I'll just show you guys the closet really quickly. It's a shared closet, but basically just have like some suitcases. I have ginger ale, my favorite soda, some just like other stuff. There's some like hooks and then there's some more storage back here, but that's basically just the closet. Um, it's really basic. And then facing the closet, you have the bathroom. So I'll show you guys the bathroom. There's me, hello. So you got a basic sink here. You also get this, you get a lot of storage. So what my roommate and I did was like, this side is hers and that side is mine. So I could show you what's in here. Not that exciting. And here I have like my face towel. And then I also have some like cotton pads and then razor toothpaste my face wash that kind of boring stuff and i just like got this divider i'm pretty sure i just got it from like home sense or something like that in this drawer i just have like a bunch of like other stuff so like a body scrub um like self tanner extra toothpaste other stuff like that and here i just have like extra bags like for storage like my um toothbrush charger and then also my hair dryer up and down there here i just have like contacts there were contacts every day um tampons pads and then this is kind of a like emergency kit which i recommend that you bring because a lot of people forget to bring band-aids and like medicine and then over here is like the shower so here's our bath mat and then this is like our towels and this is the um, toilet. And this is the shower. So this is what it looks like. And here we got a shower caddy that we share. Walking out of the bathroom, this is what it looks like. So that's the door and then that's the closet and then the two bedrooms. Also something I didn't know that came with it is you get your own thermostat so you can uh, adjust the temperature. Also for double rooms, cause this is a single room, usually this area is a little bit longer and there's actually like a kitchen sink, right? We're like right here. So normally you would have a kitchen sink if you have a double room and everything, which is kind of nice. But since we have a single room, I guess you don't get that. But coming into my room, so I'm not like very into decorating or whatever, so it's not like super cute, but this is the bed. And then this is like my closet. You also get a garbage can and recycling bin right there. This is the closet. A lot of people say that they bring too much clothes, but maybe I just don't have many clothes, but like I could fit a lot more in this closet. So I'll open it up here. So at the top, I just have like my pillow pet and some jewelry, some laundry detergent. I just got these really cute bins. They're from HomeSense. And like, I just use it to store like my socks and like my underwear. And then in here, I just store like my tank tops or whatever. And then down here are all my clothes. I have like a lot of like furry stuff and like a lot of sweaters, jackets, um, that kind of stuff up here because it takes up a lot more space. And like, here's my vest. And then I also brought like my other backpack that I never use here. As you can tell, like I could fit a lot more stuff up here. I even have some like, empty hangers this is the first drawer it's just like regular pants so i have like jeans and um like wool pants and corduroy pants i don't know and this drawer this is like the drawer that gets used the most it has like all my sweatpants and all my comfy clothes i have like t-shirts and stuff so i got a bunch of western t-shirts from a week yeah i got that and then like crop tops dresses a lot of this stuff i didn't get to wear because school got cut short because of coronavirus um like another dress oh i forgot i had this dress and then this one is just um like sportswear and like bras so as you can see i'd have a lot of space still in there i got everything from home sense except my bedding this polka dot stuff i got from the bay but yeah home sense oh this is a gift 
from my friend Paul. And yeah, home sense, home sense, home sense. And then I have a little fluffy carpet right here. Every girl has this fluffy carpet. I literally asked my dad to get it after I saw everyone had it. And then this lamp right here, which is really cool. It has like, it's touch like sensor. And then you can actually, it has a fan as well. And then also you can change the color of the light. And then my laptop. And in here, I just put a bunch of like bedside things. Retainer, this is like a discount card. I don't know, like lozenges, my glasses case, my AirPods, stuff like that. And then down here, this is like a stray fork. But um, I just have a lot of candy and snacks. So I got like popcorn chips, pudding, granola bars on days where I just running out the door. Sour Patch Kids. Over here, I have a shoe rack. And then up here is the window. My view is kind of bland. And then my friend bought this gingerbread house that we never made. And then I got all this ramen. Yeah, I love this type of ramen. This brand is so good. And then I just have a laundry basket over there. And then here is my desk. So kind of a pan there. So this chair, I originally put my fluffy white blanket on it, like this one. And then it got all pilly, like it left a bunch of pills on my chair. So I just took that off and haven't been able to get it off. Up here, I have a Keurig that I don't really use that much. Here I just have some like other hair body stuff, some water bottles, like a laptop case, my textbook. I have my other textbooks down there. So that's what, my desk looks like and then they give you these two dressers here so you get like two storages and here i have my makeup so i don't really wear much makeup but i do have like whatever makeup i do have is in here and then this one i have school supplies and then over here is my mini fridge and my backpack i'll just move that yeah and here is pretty oh okay my, my hair curl i'll just move over here i just have some like drinks a brita coffee it was more full in the beginning of the year but i've been emptying it out and then also my printer here super nice to have your own printer and then i also have some sugar here for my coffee over here i added a power outlet because like what's so weird about this room is that the outlets are so hard to use like they're so hard to plug things in and also you don't get that many of them in and they're in weird places like why is there one over there so i don't know I got an extension cord, just super helpful. So I really recommend that you guys get one too. Then just panning to the door, it's just a mirror. So just put my jackets and stuff. And that's basically it. I can do another pan. So that's the dresser, my bed. That's my other things. And then that's my desk. That's pretty much it for my room tour. There's not much to it. I really do like it though. It's a good like amount of space. I feel like it's homey and I'm yeah, really sad to say goodbye to this place. There's a lot of good memories here. Kind of sad. It's kind of bittersweet, but I am moving into a house with three other girls and I'm going to be moving into that in the summer or fall whenever I come back. Hopefully this helps future Western students if you're looking to live in O'Hall and that's about it. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, 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 o